Hello, good afternoon. It's Simon at Vans today in Worcester. I'm going to try in between the rain give you a video walk around. Uh, this is my own personal MAN TGE 3.180 four wheel drive. It is the medium wheelbase low roof. Um, we've done a, quite a few bits and pieces on it. Um, obviously, it's I don't know what is it three months old now something like that done 2300 miles at the moment that may or may not go up uh, I'm off work now for a week um, so uh, yeah it may or may not go up but uh, assume it's around about the two and a half thousand mile mark um, so um, yeah just a, a really a video um, so you get an idea of exactly what it is that you're buying Obviously, if you know about these things, if you've searched for it, you've probably already done your homework on them. You know that if you order one of these now, it's going to be a long while before it arrives. We've got a few of these coming in. Um, we have kitted this one out a little bit. Um, so, um, yeah, it's a really nice spec van, to be fair. So it's got the latest, whatever, is it nine speed auto, eight speed auto, 10 speed auto? I can't remember what it is. Um, anyway, it's got a lot of gears in the automatic gearbox. Um, it's all covered under man warranty, roadside assist, all of that malarkey on it as well. Um, it's a really high spec combi van, so it's a rare, rare bit of kit. We've ordered it in five seat combi setup. Okay, it's got twin uh, single seats in the front. They are on swivelers, so you can spin them around uh, to uh, point back at the rear seats when you're parked up if you want to. Uh, got a brand new front runner roof rack fitted to it. It's got the OZ Rally Raid uh, alloy wheels with General Grabber 83 tyres. We've got the Volkswagen wheel arch uh, extensions fitted to it as well. So these are these additional plastic extensions. We've got those fitted front and rear of the vehicle. Uh, spec wise it's the full spec on the on the head unit so you've got factory nav you've got apple carplay android auto and all of that malarkey you've got reverse parking sensor you've got front and rear sensors you've got uh lane change assist i think it's a lane change assist uh it's got the fancy um cruise control on it um automatic cruise control basically it keeps you at a set um distance from the vehicle in front uh, you've got the led drl lights fitted to it as well you've got the front fog lights fitted to it um stickers will come off it it's not a problem uh, we've got uh, both ours and dirty weekend stickers on uh, electric folding mirrors um we fitted the wind thingy mid bobs there um we've put an additional tint on your mid window so it's a twin side loading doors with the factory, so this is a factory converted combi. Um, so it's got the um, opening mid windows. We've tinted the glass as well on both sides. Condition wise, it is as you would expect it to be for a 2,000, two and a half thousand mile, whatever, three month old van. So um, in, in great condition. As you do in the video, you will see there's my personal stuff in there at the moment. Obviously, we will get all of that out and we will uh, I'll probably just send it into the detailer, get him just to do a, a fresh detail on it, um, if you have it. So, um, there you go. Uh, we've also had the rear step fitted and the factory tow pack put on the back of it as well. Uh, I think I've already mentioned the camera front runner rack, if I mentioned that. Um, what else have we got? So we've dynamated. Let me show you the back. When you buy one of these combi vans from Man, um, it comes with a completely bare back end on it, so to speak. I'm starting to talk about Man vans and bare back ends and stuff like that. I'm going to get arrested in a second. Um, and then what we've done is Dirty Weekender, uh, um, we share the same site as them, Dirty Weekender Adventure Vans. So they've fitted the flooring in it for us, okay? They fitted the uh, the cargo rail, uh, they fitted the sides as well. You have to excuse, we, we've still got the um, life jackets in from paddle boarding, my high vis over there. Got the ramp in for our uh, enduro bike. So you will fit, so you get an idea, you get fit two Husqvarna 701s in the back of here. No problem at all, because um, we've had them. Um, 
So we've gone for the Altro flooring. It's a really nice heavy duty flooring, isn't it? Um, finishes it off really nice. Obviously we'll get it all properly cleaned. It's got the Forever Silent. So with Dyna, well, the Dynamat Forever Silent, it's the, it's the same, it's not the same thing. It does the same job, isn't it? So um, this is fitted on the whole of the back end of the vehicle. Just makes it a little bit um, quieter. You've got the LED cargo lights in there as well. We've got an additional um, rear work light there as well. Inside of the rear doors, just so you can see. I know it's only done 2,000 miles, but it's, you know there are times when 2,000 miles with uh, a shed load of construction stuff in the back can ruin a van. But this is, uh, as I say, it's my own personal vehicle. I think what you might have Let's just get in the back there. I'm afraid the, one of the 701s scratched the side panel a little bit inside there. I don't think that's a major drama in it, it really is it. Um, obviously my big box of stuff I carry around with me won't be coming with it, neither will the jack, neither with the Enduro bike ramp or the all of that. It'll just come as an empty van in the back here um, and cleaned. Once it's cleaned, it will be like new, so. Um, but really shed loads of space in this van, okay? So, um, four wheel drive as well. Don't forget that. Um, it's based on the Lion XS spec, but then with a load of additional spec. Um, trying to think what else to say, really. Uh, should we have a look on the inside? So. Condition-wise, on the panels and everything, everything is bob-on on it, as you would expect it to be. Uh, front and rear mud flaps, I think, fitted to it as well. We've got uh, man rubber mats fitted front and rear. Um, ah, yeah, I've just got to refit that. We've uh, we've done um, an alarm and immobiliser and tracker system upgrade fitted to this van. So. Um, yeah, you get the app obviously, it tells you where your van is, if anybody moves it, or etc. etc. Rear seats, um, actually on the video look uh, look um, dirty, but they're, they're not really. Uh, I suppose a little bit of hoover would help, but uh, as you can see, there's some personal stuff in there. Um, rear seats, Consider, considering I think my kids have only been in it about once, then uh, yeah. Anyway, flooring, etc. everything is as you would expect. Um, front seats, you've got the nice leather multifunction steering wheel, that's an upgrade. Uh, you've got air con, you've got heated front uh, seat, you've got a heated steering wheel, you've got diff lock. Um, we've got the full build sheet on this vehicle from MAN, okay? So there's not an awful lot more we could have fitted to it, to be quite frank with you. Um, wireless Apple CarPlay and all of that so you don't have to have your phone plugged in um, yeah I think that's about it really um, as I say we've got original build sheets so if you want to confirm anything we've got the uh, original sheets with all of that on it um, and uh, yeah, when you start to add up things, you know, your OZ wheels with your general grabber tires are uh, hideous money. What were they? About 1500 quid. Roof rack, front runner. Uh, I don't know that the bill on that yet, actually, to be fair, but uh, I think it's about grand, 1500 quid's worth, 1500 quid's worth, I think. Yeah, because with these, we've gone. Yeah, well, we'll explain it to you a little bit better, but in order to fit that front runner rack, um, then you have to have a fitting kit from Volkswagen, which is 600 quid. Um, so yeah, it all adds up, doesn't it? When you start adding up all of these sort of things. LED lights, why would you not order up a brand new one of these with LED lights when you've got the opportunity? So that's what we've done. Um, obviously it's got my private plate on it, we'll be taking that off. Um, and that's about it, I think, really. Um, you know, we can fit more stuff to it. We've got a snorkel, we've got laser lamps. Um, if you want anything else doing to it, Dirty Weekender, who we share our premises with, can sort anything out for it that you want. Basically, if you want a full conversion done on it, you can do. 
you know, for us, we just wanted a five seat combi van. Um, and uh, yeah, I wanted four wheel drive, wanted auto. But there's a few more coming. There's a couple of other things I've got in the pipeline as well. So if this thing sells, it sells. If it doesn't, we'll keep it. But it gives you an idea. I'm not overly fussed, to be quite frank with you. It's a lovely bit of kit. Um, but there is the opportunity there. Should you want it, let us know. Um, who are you, who you buying off? Uh, we're Vans today. We're based in Worcester in the centre of the country, offering you nationwide delivery, part exchange and finance. Feel free to give us a call 01905 672080 or email us sales at vanstoday.com. If uh, you're worried about who you're buying off, check out our reputation online. We've got reviews on Google, Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, etc, etc. Thanks for looking and um, feel free to give us a shout. Cheers.